and welcome back to my channel. So I have for you today a rather large Tesco food tour. Hope you enjoy. This is a pretty gigantic order for us this week. It was just one of those weeks where a lot of things had run out. So I will start over in this corner. I bought two four pints of whole milk because every single week without fail, I'm having to go out and buy another one. And I just think like both kids drink it and it just goes really, really quickly. So I've got two of those a four pint of semi-skimmed and then I bought two of the thick lemon bleaches just because we had totally run out of those two of the non bio detergent capsules I really really like these they're obviously their own brand they're two for five pounds uh, 20 washes so five pound gets you 40 washes and everyone comments how nice the clothes smell so actually I'm just gonna stick with these and not shell out on branded goods when I don't have to same goes with this Tesco pure fabric conditioner it's the sensitive one so it's fine with the kids 42 washes and I think it's something around about one pound fifty ish I have to look at the receipt I can't find the receipt at the moment I think I might have dropped it somewhere in the house when I was unpacking so I will have a look at that but cheaper than other brands so i'm happy with that as well and then i got a pack of fairy original all-in-one i did have to pay full price for those they were five pounds so it's a bit more than i would normally spend but we are totally out of them so we have to get them 20 bin bags we just use these in our kitchen bin and then i got a dr beckman carpet stain remover that was three pounds absolutely love that it is so brilliant it takes all the stains out of our carpet obviously having two young kids it happens all the time and there hasn't yet touch wood been a stain that it hasn't been able to remove so yeah love it and again we had run out of that so pick that one up four of the no added sugar baked beans normally get a four pack but they didn't have them so they're just four and they were 30 pence each so i think it worked out very slightly more to get them individually but again totally run out so we needed them two paracetamol and then some nappy bags i got these because they were three four 150 i think and we have only got one pack left. These will last us a long, long time. So they were three pound for six, which seemed a good buy. I got one of these Americano, is it Azeras? We love this. It's like a powdered coffee and it's just a really nice flavor, quite mellow. We just enjoy it. And then I got some sweetness as well, because that's what I have in my coffee now. And then I got some head to toe wash for the kids. And also I didn't mean to buy two. I don't, I think I hadn't realized one of them was in there, but we've got a raspberry bath and body wash. These are only a pound each for Tesco's own and they smell really nice. The kids like them. They don't really have a reaction from them. So all is good. And then I got one of these, they were on offer. I think it was one pound 50 down from about two twenty. So just to keep stocked up. And then I got a Nurofen as well. Couldn't get any cow pole. We're totally out of it, which worries me sick. Um, but that was one thing that we couldn't get because they, I think they have had some panic buyers. And then two of the palm olives. These are only 85 pence full price. Absolutely love them. Uh, that's what I use all the time. I don't know how my sweet potatoes ended up down here, but anyway, it has. So, oh, and I've got another bin bag. I think these must have been on offer because I didn't remember picking two up. But, and yeah, random sweet potato, don't quite know why it's there. Uh, one of the Country Life butters, that was down from around about 3 three fifty down to 2 25 So I'll pop that in the fridge so that we've got one for when the other one runs out. And then a creamy tomato and her bake, that's what I always get the kids anyway to have as a tuna bake. And then I got one of the bolognese sauces just in case. I would just feel happier if we just had one jar of pasta sauce in the cupboard just in case. So I have panic by to a certain degree, but only with one jar of pasta sauce. So I'm thinking that's acceptable. Um, the small beers, because they're only three pounds something, you get 10 in there and they're just nice for my husband. He doesn't want a massive beer, just a small bottle in the evening. Three of the apple and raspberry spring waters, just because they're free on Slimming World and it makes a change from diet coke all the time. A big box of shreddies. Absolutely love shreddies at the moment. I have them warm with milk and sweetener and I just love them in the winter. Four of these Singapore curry noodles. I know they're not free on Slimming World anymore. They used to be when I did it the first time. A bit gutted actually that they're not because I lived on those for lunch, but it is what it is. Uh, I can't remember if they're two, three or four sins. I don't have them very often. My husband actually quite likes taking these for work sometimes, um, but either way, I'm still happy to have one occasionally for lunchtime and just sin what the value is. Two of packs of the small bananas. My kids really wanna make some banana bread. And we never get to make it because our bananas never have chance to go brown. So I thought I'm going to double up on bananas this week. And then a couple of them will probably be left over to do some banana bread or banana cake, whatever you call it. So that's why I've got double bananas. Some easy peelers. 
these always look really dinky when you order them online and then we send through absolutely massive ones i actually just wanted like the mini ones but anyway they'd, they'd be fine my daughter loves them she just could eat these all day long uh some baby plum tomatoes and then these baby cucumbers which i've got before these are just really nice you just top and tail them slice them and they're done for the kids and they just really like them a pack of raspberries and then two strawberries They've actually substituted these. I ordered a different brand and they've sent these perfectly imperfect ones, but they're fine by me. A pack of carrots and then I got some salad. I went for the baby leaf one, probably because it was on offer, I would expect. I get things on offer mostly. I'd probably say like 70% of my shop generally is from the offer section because I hate paying full price. Unless it's just like own brand goods, which don't cost too much. I try and bargain hunt when I can. Over the back there, I've got a broccoli, some kitchen foil, some garden peas. And then I've actually bought a pack of sliced mixed peppers because we're having a lot of kind of ricey stir fry type dishes at the moment. And we always get to the day and we don't have peppers and I have to go and buy them. And I thought, actually, I'm just going to keep a frozen pack of sliced peppers in the freezer just in case. And then we don't have the panic of having to go out and buy some. Some red seedless grapes, they were £2. And then these were a pound each. So I got eight for my husband. He really likes those ones. I got two chicken breast fillets, £1.80. So it's pretty good. I've got some others in the freezer. So it's just so that we've got enough to do a dinner. And then eight thick Richmond sausages. I realise these are not sin free or even low sin, but the kids just like these ones. These are the ones they eat. No herbs, no fattiness, I guess. That's what it probably is, but that's why they're there. And then a 5% steak mince because that's free on Slimming World. 10 codfish fingers for my children. Wafer thin cooked ham. Coronation chicken for my husband's sandwiches because he just likes to change every now and then. Some fruits for the kids. One of these baguettes, again, this is just so cheap. I think they're like 40 pence or something for a baguette. Cornish pasty for my husband. This is Kids Corner, as I've mentioned before. I don't touch this. Uh, some Jeffa Cake bars for the treat cupboard and then the dairy milk and the Kinder bars just to keep stocked up and the Mary Lamb minis. That's all going in the kids' cupboard out of sight. A nine pack of toilet roll, some penne pasta. We went for the twisty, twirly usually however you say it but they've sent that so that's fine and then we've got two of the oven baked walkers one pom bears for the children and then a block of medium cheddar a best of both hobis custard creams for my husband and then last but not least is a pack of hash browns because the kids are really enjoying having like a grilled breakfast at the weekend at the moment and they really really like these uh, so that's why we've got those and that is everything so Oh, it was an expensive shop this week. This came to £115. That's a lot of money, isn't it? But we just had the week where we had to stock up and that is an expensive shop and definitely I will try and cut down on next week's shop just to uh, claw back a little bit of money somewhere. But this will keep us going nicely. Thanks so much for watching my video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like to subscribe to my channel, that would be great. I'm also on Instagram with the name mama underscore hedgehog too. And on the lovely channel mum with the name mama hedgehog. See you soon. Bye.